Deserts, Friend or Foe by Amy Allinson. What to do if you are lost in the desert? How did you come to be here in the desert in the first place? Well, there are many reasons you could wind up in such a place. Perhaps you got a flat tyre, or your camel ran off. Whatever the reason, the first thing you've got to do is find water. Second, you've got to protect yourself from the sun. Look for shade quickly. You can always make a better shelter once the sun has gone down. In the diagram, as you can see, we have a shelter here. Warning. Keep your mouth closed as valuable droplets of moisture will ev evaporate if you don't. It's a good idea to keep your mouth closed because you need to preserve as much water and moisture as possible. Things that you need to take with you in order to survive. A vehicle with 4x4 drive, fuel for the vehicle, eye protection, water, food, a camel, which we have here in the diagram, cling film, a tent, a sleeping bag, sun cream and a cooker and water purifier. A daily routine for surviving in the desert. If you have a car, example, you were driving through and it broke down, it's best to stay on the outside in, during the day as this offers some shade. At night, stay inside the car as it may offer some warmth. Keep hydrated. If you have a cold drink on you or water, you need to make it last. If unfortunately you don't have water, you need to find some and fast. The best way to do this is find a plant that's still alive. So this involves travelling, but don't travel too far away from the car if you have a car. When you've, when you've found a plant that is still alive, which you can see in the diagram we have one here and one here, you dig at its base and, and you might find some water or some damp sand. Keep going and finding plants and doing the same thing until you find water or damp sand. Once you have found the water, you will need to place it in a container. Then dig a hole in the ground. Place the container into the centre of the hole. Place some cling film over the top or any other types of plastic will be fine to use. Cover the sides of the cling film and place a rock in the middle and come back the next day and it will be safe to drink. Next, you will need to get food. If you have a camel, when it dies, you can sleep inside it to keep warm and you can eat and you can eat it. The best thing to eat on the camel is the humps as they are basically fat. Some other things that you might need to take with you or do when you get there are um, you should never travel alone. You should plan your route carefully and let someone know where you're going and coming back. When you're driving, keep your thumb on the outside of the wheel. Travel at high speed so you don't sink it into the ground. Take sand maps with you. Stay in the same place and build a fire with thick smoke. You can always burn the tyres of your car, which you can see, and we are in this fire here. Always assume the worst. Make sure you're always in the shade and keep insulation. And get something to sit on. And keep your mouth shut. Don't over ration. Stay cool and build a V shape in the sand as it is usually seen as a warning sign for people passing by. Build three fires, which we have here, as we have one here, one here, and one here. 
And then remember, every day that passes, time is running out. And make sure you have something to protect your head. Those are a couple of few tips to help you survive in the desert. Thank you.